What's up everybody? We're back here on a Monday morning again. I don't even know what date it is. It's April 20th. We're still here working. But, guess what we got in the building? We haven't seen this car since we touched it and we put the ceramic coating. Now it has the wheels, everything. The car looks crazy. All right, what's up everybody? We're about to detail this vehicle, this uh, Jetta, as we speak right now. The carpet on this car is dirty. Well, not the carpet, but the seats. It's pretty dirty, so we're about to give it a good makeover and, you know, go from there. All right, we're back. If you guys can see, the passenger seat looks really nasty. Um, I just got done with the driver's seat real quick. Um, a lot of freaking gunk and dirt came out of that seat. You know, halfway there, almost done. So, you know, I'll show you guys the, when, when I'm done, I'll show you the finish. See how good the job came out. Okay, okay, it is Wednesday. We're out here at Reflections doing some specialty work, as always. I am not showing you how to steal your own car. You I guess hear. accidents happen, you know how it is. You didn't hear it from me, this is how you do it. <laughs> how you don't open the sliding window in the rear, break the little, oh wait, none of those. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, it's hot as a bitch. And seeing as this is probably gonna take a little while, I'll cut to the chase here in about right now. Okay, we are back with the next project. We are doing a paint correction on this BMW. Do a quick walk around, maybe show you some of the scratches that are on this. I think it's a little dirty to see those scratches, but definitely has a lot of swirl marks. All right, what's up everybody? Back again with another paint correction, because you know, we have to stay busy. You know, we go by quality here 
a lot so that's why I don't like to rush one one day turnarounds two day turnarounds I like to do it take my time on the car make sure the car gets exactly exactly what it's supposed to get and especially for you to get your money's worth so you know that's basically we're about here in reflections and my head's all backwards all crooked oh yeah and I locked my keys inside my truck so that was pain in the ass to do today so that mostly with where three of my hours went by trying to unlock my truck and trying to get this done by today so you know it is what it is all right so like I was saying we're back um this what this guy this car right here was for one of our offices here in Vegas you know we did a, we hooked them up it was a one day special um I really don't like to do this one day turnarounds to a lot of cars because it's I don't know I just don't it doesn't, doesn't fit my quality standards it doesn't go good with anything I don't like it so yeah car's done perfect he's gonna love it it's you know shine off this truck it's all shiny it's all perfect Koi's over there still wiping it because he loves BMW no, man. So we have two projects going on right now. Um, we got our company vehicle charger. We're gonna put some lowering springs on today and hopefully that goes good for us. You know, some things that we do personally on our own. We don't do it to customers. So don't ask and don't order and say, hey, can you guys do this custom? Now this is for our personal use. So don't get crazy people. But yeah, we're gonna put this uh, HRs uh, springs on them. It's only gonna lower them a little bit. Nothing impressive. Also, we have uh, Mr. Organic's vehicle here, so we're gonna ceramic coat the front, uh, ceramic coat the wheels basically, and the calipers also. So first of all, I have to take them off. Uh, take them off and then wash them and clean them. Uh, really good. So you know we can you know get everything. The floaters, everything gets washed pretty good. So you know do a proper job do a proper job you know so everything can go smoothly okay i'm gonna start installing these uh springs right here we're gonna do a quick time lapse and uh bring you along
All right, what's up, everybody? Monday morning, here at Reflections, like always. Busy, like always, haircuts, everything. Uh, unfortunately, he's not gonna get a haircut today because he's broke. Uh, she doesn't want to give him a loan, so we don't know what to do. And then out there, we got an orange car right there, getting to see if we can get in real quick. But, you know, <sighs> now we have, we lowered the right side on this car already. Now we're doing to do the uh, the left side, and we're gonna drop it down, and then you guys are gonna see the new the springs already on. <laughs> all right, all right, I'm back. I'm back. Let's go mess around with the wrap, guys, because you know I got nothing better to do. Yeah, I'm bringing the camera, bro. What's up? <laughs> Stuff in my face. What's going on? Look at that. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> They're trying to finish up the Mustang real quick. We moved it over here. Uh, yeah, the Mustang is looking pretty good right now. Everything's coming together. Bumpers putting back together. You know, small things at a time. But this Mustang is gonna look sick when it's done. The color looks nice. I have seen. I have seen people. Um, Take battery corrosion off with coke. It works. It works. Mm -hmm. Yep. I, I do those with pennies sometimes. But you've yeah. never seen coke when it's all fucking dried up in the sun and all that shit. Oh, like, yeah. It's all nasty. Oh, you never seen that? That's just crazy, dude. It's all like. All right, t tell me a little bit about you know your your work right here. After you know you're done shoving your mouth right now with some full of penis. Tell me right now what's. Let me first, and I'll give you an interview. <laughs> 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 yeah, man, you're gonna forget later on. <laughs> Yeah, all right, so he's gonna come back and give me an interview. I'll let him eat real quick. I was pressuring him. Man. Remember when I said he was gonna give us an interview after he's done eating? Two freaking hours later, he forgot. Hey, dude, I'm back with the camera. What's up? Hey, remember that interview you said you were gonna give me? I do. Yeah, I'm, I'm here now. Ah, this is correspondent Carlos. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let me go turn it down a little bit. I'll be back. <laughs> nah, don't do that. Oh. Don't come oh. over here with that fucking energy. Woo. I don't give a shit. Woo, you y'all heard that? Fuck oh. out of this bitch, I swear to God. Yeah. Headlights go in, bumper goes on. I gotta build the vents for the hood. Right. I gotta put the antenna back in. I gotta put the wing back on. Wow. I gotta put the fender liners back in. Damn, that's not a lot. Nah, just a little, you know, Lego things putting back together. Yeah. How many years you been doing this? Professionally? Uh, yeah. Other tenth, right? Yeah. Like On the passenger side? Yeah. Uh, professionally? Yeah. Six years. Six years? Right. Mm. Unprofessionally? A lot longer. <laughs> Let me guess, your first car was a Honda Civic? Nope, pretty close though. Toyota Corolla? Nope. Honda Fiat? Nope. Mm. 
Let me guess. Acre Integra? Nope. Mm. You're pretty close with the first guess. Acre, I mean, a uh, cord? No, yep. Civic. A cord? Yep. Oh. So I gotta hold this down so you can tighten it up. <laughs> what? And then I worked on my first Ferrari and I shit my pants and I was like, oh wait, this is kind of cool. <laughs> this is what I'm gonna do the rest of my life. Yep, shit my pants and work on Ferraris. But, as you guys can see, putting it all back together right now. It's gonna come along really clean. 